Hello BSD community members, it's March 24th and I wanted to provide an update on some things that have happened uh, over the weekend and into early this week. First of all, I hope everyone, all of our friends, family members, neighbors are taking care of themselves, taking care of uh, making sure we're using all precautions to stay healthy. Um, it's also a, a reminder during this difficult time that uh, we're all dependent on each other because really my health is dependent on everyone else taking steps to make sure they stay healthy. So we're in it as a community. <clears throat> Our uh, emotional health depends on supporting each other. So please be in touch with your friends and relatives who might be uh, isolated in homes. Let's take care of together. Together we can overcome this adversity. The governor uh, yesterday announced that schools will be closed uh, with students returning on April 9th. Uh, that would give two days for employees to come back, the 7th and 8th, with the idea that students would come in on the 9th, which is, which is Thursday. Um, I should mention all of this information that I'm sharing now, more details are, will be emailed to parents via parent emails and also posted on all of our social media sites, including the district website. So we don't know if we'll actually come back uh, for students on April 9th, um, but We'll aim to uh, do that at this point. We'll see what happens in the coming weeks. As of this coming Monday, March 30th, we are going to gear up uh, online and extended learning opportunities for our students K-12. So again, there's a lot more information in the letter that we're sending out and posting online, but our goal really is not to try to replicate a full school day for students. That's not gonna happen. This is gonna be far from perfect, but we do wanna give learning opportunities to all of our students. So teachers and principals will be in touch with our families and our students to let them know how we see things rolling out. But we really anticipate, um, we, we don't wanna overstress families that are already in stressful situations because of the pandemic, but we absolutely wanna give learning opportunities uh, to students and students will be expected to participate in those learning opportunities and to complete assignments that are made by their teachers uh, through online instruction. For kindergarten through middle school, we'll also have hard copy learning packets available uh, for pickup at our meal distribution sites. That's also uh, listed in the letter that I'm, that I'm going to send home. So we're in a brave new world. This is all new. Our teachers are gonna do their best and I have complete confidence they're gonna do an awesome job. Our students, we need you to step up as well at home and uh, accept the online responsibilities. A lot more independence to try to, to make sure you're doing things that you need to do on your own. Uh, we have a lot of very important events that have already been canceled, others that uh, hang in the balance now, but we're gonna do everything we can to make sure the most important events at the end of the year, such as graduations, happen um, depending on the rules that the governor has in place for us. So please uh, look out for each other, look for information coming from your principals and teachers uh, so we can get rolling next week with online learning. Good luck to everybody, stay healthy, take care of each other.